Hello, welcome back to Tanky's Playtime. I'm sorry this video is taking a little while. I've just been a little bit busy. Been on holiday as well. Well, it hasn't been all, all, all so long. I've had a little holiday. Right, now I'm over. Welcome to Tanky's Playtime in sunny Spain. Ooh, I'm sorry, I'm going to take We're going to take That's better. Why am I steering? Oh, one foot off the pedal. Welcome to Tanky's Playtime here in sunny Spain. Hey, a little holiday for us, we'll keep us out of the workshop. And I've been out on the road as well, transporting as well, so... Yeah, sorry it took a while to actually get this done, um, but here we go. This is the next part to the lorry build. So, don't forget to like and subscribe, smash that bell button, and I'll catch you soon. Good night. <laughs> Yeah, don't worry.
Yeah, I'm gonna get punched in there. I was like, you guys are hard. That was gonna be, that's gonna be fun to get punched on. As I say, if you get punched on, bye. Alright. Okay, I'll get punched on. Just. I'm gonna pass the hell by you. Get back in the car. Get back in the So what I've got is basically a tap system. So should there be a pipe I decide to die, I've got a way of shutting the tank down before it drains all the oil out of it. Um, where the Arctics, they're all back feeds are on top of the tank, these are on the back. So if there is such a thing as it even goes, it's, you know, there's nothing to stop it draining down. So, all three. So obviously that's my return from my, uh, from my winches and everything. This is the backup, which goes on to the blow off so it should be a dead stop it'll come up through into this line and obviously that's my low pressure feed as well that goes to the pump so we'll quickly and what I've done is I've just got some lengths of pipe and I'm just cutting them to size and just temporary fitting them and then we'll go and get them all made up so uh, yeah let's go and make these up I'm just gonna literally just put things on loose ready for swaging. We also got this bit here, so we've got that to the safety valve. So this valve here, I'm oh sorry, you've got a safety valve here. That then links to this valve here. Now this is a flow divider. What it's gonna do is keep my winches, if one shuts down, it'll keep them all at equal speeds. So we'll make it, we'll temporarily make up a pipe to fit between those two. And then, so that's an inch feed in, two half inches out, which will go down to the spool blocks in the side of the toolboxes. Let's make that one up. <laughs> And 
that's mocked up at this point now. So I've now got the feed into the pump mocked. Then I've got the feed from the pump to the safety valve. The safety valve blowback pipe on. We've mocked up this pipe now to the flow diverter. And now we've got the two pipes which are going to go to the toolbox. And I'll go up over, over the top of this prop, back down, and eventually we'll make it into the back of this box. So, uh, yeah. Thank you. 
there. <clears throat> right, I'll open that window in case you need a shout, all right? Uh, which part is it again? See you, look. Well, that's a good start. Oh, here we go. That's a really good start. IVA the truck, uh, it has passed. We, had, we didn't have too much issue, we just had to take, you know, actually over sticking it a little bit, uh, a bit closer to the brake lights. But that was a quick remedy, we did that while it's there, so that's all passed. It is now in the hands of Scania. They are now doing a PDI and they are just putting some lights on and doing bits for their doing. So, I will do is I will, once I get it on the road, um, I will do another release of a video and we'll do a, uh, well, we'll do a, a, the first out trip, go and pick caravan up, I suppose. So, um, yeah, don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll catch you all again soon. I'm going to go out for a track and go for a blip. I fancy an ice cream. Stay lucky, get to the workshop, get to your projects. I'll see you later. Stay safe.